Oh, well, hey there. Hey, Phil. What do we got? Oh, we got a garden of abundance going. Well, it looks like it. Well, your green stock's looking good, although those strawberries are a little questionable. Well, if you look closer, you can see new green life on them. Oh, yeah. So they're hanging right there. in there. And then uh, your Those herbs are looking made. good. Hey. And then check this out. You're going to want one of these guys. What's that? Garlic chive flour. They Ooh. are delicious. Those are really good. Mm -hmm. I gotta try not to eat them all. I need some to give me seeds. And then uh, check it out, my potatoes are coming up in my cool Coca-Cola cooler. You think that's cool? I got one about five times that size. Really? Uh-huh. Is it metal like mine? So anyway, it's a big Coke cooler. It's like five <laughs> times that size. So it's plastic. So I think I'm gonna plant potatoes in it. It might be plastic. Well, you think you'd do better than me, huh? Yeah. I'll, well, have to, we'll see. I'll have to get some slips from you. Go away, buggies. Go away. Leave my taters alone. Let's and then uh, my cut come again lettuce is drying. I just watered it so it's all kind of now, down from the water. Is that the same as miner's lettuce? It's just a mix of different lettuce seeds oh. that you throw in a pot. Yeah. And you just cut it whenever you need some lettuce and it'll grow back, they say. Really? Yeah, so I'm trying it out. Cut, cut, uh, I believe yeah. I've seen that from David the Good. What's this guy down here? This is a basil thing that I bought at uh, Home Depot. And the coconut gourd thing they gave me, that's all the much it filled. So mm. we'll see. I got a bunch of coconut koi. Me? If, if you need some, I, 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 use, I might need more. When I do my mushrooms, that's what I use. Right, right. Well, see, I use it for Spot's Cage too. So, and then I have her fertilizer to add to my dirt when I clean her I was going to say, you then you got the fertilizer. Yep. What else if you got? Don't, if anybody don't know, Spot is my turtle. Yeah. It's okay. a worthless animal. Yeah, she's smarter than you. Then uh, my Meyer lemon is turning a few of them yellow, but I mean, I was gone for a couple of days, so it didn't get watered, so, but I'm hoping. I mean, it still looks good and everything. Not edible, but your hen and chicks are looking great. They're going crazy. Yeah. And then, uh, apparently I accidentally got some onion that would grow in my leaf mold. Well, look at that. But that's all full of leaves again and everything stuff. And then my strawberries, we're getting strawberries. Look at all these strawberries over here forming. Oh, would you, would you look at that? They are just all over the place, baby. Wow. Yeah. You need to get these trees planted. It looks like they're getting bucket bound or something. I know, I gotta get them in the ground. Hopefully my son shows up today to mow my lawn and have him help me. Oh, and then I got us a wild animal type thing, Phil. Uh oh. Wait maple, a second. Maple seeds. Oh, okay. One for you, one for me. You can eat them raw. Now, is this the seed, not the helicopter? Not the whole helicopter, just the seed that's inside there. Oh. All right. So you eat yours first, and I'll eat mine. That's fine. I'm just peeling this little outer skin off them. Just in case that's a little bitter. Oh, take your time. I am. All right, you ready? Yeah. Don't taste like maple. Well, I wouldn't think so. It's Pre getting a little bitterness to it. I think when they're green, it might be a little better. It'd be pretty awesome if they tasted like maple. It would be. All right, I'll try mine here. Uh, maple seed. See, it's right there. It's crunchy. Mm -hmm. I really like the crunch. They're, they're supposed to be kind of like pumpkin seeds when you roast them. Okay, I, the crunch is great. The mouthfeel is great. But there's a little bit too much bitter for me. I, I think the bitter is because uh, I did get them yesterday, so they dried out for a day. Okay. So that might be where the bitterness came from. So, but yeah, they say if you get them in the spring, they're more sweeter. And then like if you save them and dry them or whatever, then they get more bitter. You know, but they said you can save them and dry them and have them for winter. Nice. And everything and stuff, so.